Elizabethan period. Elizabethan period is dated from 1558 to 1603. Literature of the Renaissance typically appeared in the poem and drama form. Authors from this period are often associated with the rediscovery of the classics by the Greeks and Romans. The main themes of the poems are truth, temperance, chastity, friendship, justice, and courtesy. Poets used repetition to emphasize their themes. Sir Philip Sidney, Sir Thomas Wyatt, Henry Howard, and Edmund Spencer are the major Elizabethan and Renaissance poets. University wits. The university wits is a phrase used to name a group of late 16th century English playwrights and pamphleteers who were educated at the universities, Oxford and Cambridge, and who became popular secular writers. Christopher Marlowe, Robert Greene, and Thomas Nash from Cambridge, and John Lilly, Thomas Lodge, and George Peel from Oxford are called university wits. Other dramatists of this period include Thomas Kidd, John Hayward, Henry Medwall, Thomas Norton, Thomas Sockville, and Nicholas Udall. Major dramatist Shakespeare, the 16th century, or Renaissance period, was the golden age of English drama. William Shakespeare is the most dignified outer of this genre. Renaissance prose The prose writer of this era include Sir Francis Bacon, Richard Hooker, Thomas Decker, Richard Hacklute, Walter Raleigh, Robert Burton, and Thomas Brown. Jacobean period. The age is named after James I, who reigned England from 1603 to 1625. The word Jacobean is derived from Jacobus, the Latin version of James. Shakespeare's later works are included in this era. Measure for Measure, Othello, Macbeth, King Lear, Antony and Cleopatra, Coriolanus, Titan of Athens, Pericles, Cymbeline, The Winter's Tale, The Tempest and Henry VIII are the examples. Notable authors of this period include Ben Jonson, Thomas Middleton, Francis Bacon, Thomas Decker, John Webster, Francis Beaumont, Cyril Tourner, John Fletcher, John Donne, Thomas Hayward, and Philip Massinger. Metaphysical Poets the term metaphysical was coined by the critic Samuel Johnson to describe a loose group of 17th century English poets whose work was characterized by their inventive use of conceits. Their work is notable for its ingenious use of intellectual and theological concepts in surprising conceits, strong paradoxes and far-fetched imagery. The poets included John Donne, George Herbert, Andrew Marwell, Abraham Cowley, Richard Crawshaw, and Henry Vaughan. Caroline Age, dated from 1625 to 1649, the Caroline Age is named after Charles I. The term is derived from Caroline, the Latin for Charles. He married Henrietta Maria of France in the same years in 1625 when he was crowned to English throne. The Cavalier Poets, a collective term applied to a group of English lyric poets of the Caroline period and derived from the popular designation for supporters of King Charles in the Civil War. Poets included Thomas Carew, Richard Lovelace, Robert Herrick, and John Suckling. The Cavalier poets are noted for their elegantly witty short lyric poems, usually love poems. They were influenced by Ben Jonson. Characteristics of this era, the period from 1620 to 1660 is called the Puritan Age. During this era, colonial territories were expanding. Religious conflicts were revived in this period, that were subsided in Elizabethan period. Protestants were divided into, Anglican, Presbyterian, and Puritans. Renaissance influence continued in this era. Scotland was brought under the rule of the King of England. Major authors of this period are, John Milton George Herbert Robert Herricksons of Ben. Sons of Ben, Sons of Ben were the followers of Ben Jonson in English poetry and drama. In the first half of the 17th century, these men followed Ben Jonson's philosophy and his style in poetry, being inspired by his dramatic, artistic techniques. Richard Brome, Thomas Nabbs, Henry Glapthrone, Sir William Davenant, and William Cartwright are called the Sons of Ben. Tribe of Ben. The term, or the alternative tribe of Ben was a self-description by some of the Cavalier poets who admired and were influenced by Johnson's poetry. Commonwealth period, Puritan interregnum, 
1649-1660. The Commonwealth was the political structure during the period of 1649-1660 when England and Wales, later Ireland and Scotland, were governed as a republic after the end of the Second English Civil War and the trial of Charles I. Oliver Cromwell was an English general and statesman who led the Parliament of England's armies against King Charles I during the English Civil War, and ruled the British Isles as Lord Protector from 1653 until his death in 1658. Cromwell helped to bring about the overthrow of the Stuart monarchy. 